Hello and welcome to this video where I'm going to be going over the Builder All Quiz Builder. This is going to be great in case you want to build a uh, any type of Builder All Quiz Funnel or maybe you want to collect leads, get some answers, and direct them to a relevant page that's going to be suited on the answers that they pick. If you'd like to test out Builder All or follow along, I will put a unique link in the description. And if you click that, you can actually get a free 14-day trial as opposed to going to their homepage and just straight out buying it. So uh, let's begin. Once you're in the Quiz Builder app, what you want to do is do create a new quiz and it'll take you to a page that looks very similar to this. I gave it a name called best traffic source for this example and I'm going to click on create. Okay, so we have our best traffic source and enter the basic settings of your quiz. What I want to do here is add a description and an upload. So give me a second. I'm going to do that. All right, so I put quiz about the best possible traffic sources to use as an online marketer. And then we uploaded an image. Keep in mind, best format here is going to be 600 by 3. You can always change that around using like paint or something similar uh, online if you want. There's also going to be a cover description. I'm just not going to show this if you wanted to. It's just an extra step, but you can add your title, your description, and your button's going to be like click here to start the quiz. I just feel like it's an unnecessary step, so I'm not going to show that. When it comes to answering, only answer once is fine. Um, you can do sharing if you want where it says like, this is the result I got. And if someone wants to share it, they can do that. Then for this, you're gonna to wanna to select the mailing boss list, or you can choose different lists according to the result, but I'm just gonna put everyone on one. So I'm gonna click on this and choose mine. So mine is called email marketing. And what I wanna do is kind of give them an idea of like what you should do and the reason why you're gonna to wanna to put in your email. So allow me to do that very quickly. So I put get a special video dedicated to your answer and enter your email address to continue. As simple as that, let's click on save. And let's go to results. So the results are going to be where someone goes ultimately once they're done. With this, I want to do a redirect because what that's going to do is take them to a very specific landing page. Okay. So if you want to do it this way, keep in mind, you're going to have to have specific landing pages for the answers that you use. So for example, let's go with redirect. And this answer is going to be about YouTube. So what happens is that when someone uses this, they're going to get taken to a landing page that I've already created. So let me go to that. So out of my social media landing pages, I have a YouTube one. So what happens is they're interested in YouTube. They like YouTube. They're going to get more information, content, and value related to YouTube. Okay. I'm also going to add a very quick uh, image right here. And what I'm going to do is repeat that process for the other results that I want to have. I think I'll do it two more times. I'll just show you very quickly. So once I'm done with this, I'll, I'll talk about it a little. So this second one here is going to be about Twitter. So once again, it's going to go to the Twitter page. We have a redirect. I'm not going to add an image here. Obviously, that's where you can add it. And the last one's going to be all about Facebook. So we have a redirect once again, going to Facebook. Okay, so Facebook lines up and let's save that. Those are going to be the results. Now we have the questions. For this, I'm just going to ask one single question. Okay, we're already familiar with it. So allow me to add it in. Okay, so I put what is the best traffic source? In your opinion, what's the best traffic source for online marketers? And of course, I added an image, something you've seen. And here we are when it comes to this. So I'm going to have uh, a few labels with this. So let's do the first one. Okay, so we have YouTube. And then of course, we want another option. What else did we have? We had Twitter. And then of course, we had Facebook. Perfect. So you can add an option that makes uh, to write any text. You can do random order of questions, which I kind of like. It's always going to be random. I'll allow multiple answers. We're just going with one because we want the best. So let's click on save and email config. You can send email with each answer. You can send email notification or send result by email, which I'm not really care to do too much. I'd rather just you know send them to where they go and collect the lead. And last but not least, we have our style. So you can do image answers. You can change around the color themes. We have the elements and the items. That's really gonna be up to you. That's more of like aesthetics and how it looks. So what I wanna do is click save since we're done with that. I can turn this on. Of course, make sure it's published. Now let's take a look at it. Allow me to open this up in a new incognito window. So let me copy this, give me one sec. Okay, so what is the best traffic source? In your opinion, what's the best traffic source for online markers? Let's go with YouTube. And get a special video dedicated to your answer. Enter your email address below to continue. I'm just gonna add in a random email here. Okay, so we have random email five at AOL.com. Let's click on next. Give it a second to load. Okay, and as you see there, it showed the picture of YouTube and then said redirecting. So like I said, I didn't do like much with this, but it's more just giving the idea of that once you're done, you send them to a specific YouTube related page or landing page. So this could be something about video, maybe a great video you have when it comes to the testimonials. Say if you had your own offer, if you had a webinar, you know, you could talk more about that. And then you could do like maybe getting on a call with someone. You could just do a straight value video if you wanted to do it that way. But what this is doing is really 
narrowing down the interest of your specific audience and then giving them more information about what they're looking for. That's the value of quizzes. It's kind of like someone saying, hey, are you interested in in this? And they're like, yes, I want this. So you give them more of what they want. Uh, the, the very common example is if uh, you're selling pizza and people want pizza, don't give them hot dogs. You know what I mean? It's like there's incongruence. So you're giving them exactly what you want. And it's a pretty straightforward process overall. I think that it could be a little bit cleaned up in terms of like the loading time in between. It is still in beta. So, you know, hopefully that will be improved a little bit, but kind of just my constructive criticism when going through it. But those overall are the steps when it comes to using Builderall for like their quiz funnel or their quiz feature. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. If you'd like to test out Builder, I will also have a link for that in the description. That about does it. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.